This is my new tube drum. I've been working on uh, throwing donuts on the potter's wheel lately, and so I, you know, took two of them, stuck them together, and then cut one up and turned it into these tubes. Um, and then just made this bowl thing. I put that on there also. Uh, and then I glazed the whole thing in uh, blue and yellow. And this is what happened. I really, really like the way this came out. <laughs> this is a sort of softer drum. Um, you could, I suppose, play it loudly, but uh, I've mostly been playing it pretty softly and really enjoying it. You can play it on your lap, <clears throat> which is also fun. It's really weird because the instrument's in stereo. When you hit over here, it's like you're hearing more sound come out of this tube than you are this one. But when you hit this one, it's distinctly coming out of only here. Um, and then, oddly enough, this tube, the second from the left, is, uh, is coming out mostly this side. Last one's kind of both. See, that doesn't really do as much. This really bends the pitch. totally slap these things with paddles. That would make a lot more noise. I don't have a, I don't have a shoe around, but um, any kind of uh, like flip-flop would completely work.
I'm playing these with one finger. These drum heads are so small. I'm really just, I'm really just hitting them kind of near their rim with one finger. This I'm playing with my palm. Like the fattier part of my palm. whole thing is made of stoneware ceramic. It's glazed with blue glass and yellow glass, and it's got calfskin heads on the drums. It is 23 inches tall. It is 14 inches wide and uh, about 10 pounds.